Today, exclusive India Today has tracked down former Mumbai top cop Parambir Singh. While exclusively speaking to India Today in Mumbai, Parambir Singh said that he has come to join the investigation as asked by the Supreme Court and he has full faith in the judiciary. Earlier, Parambir Singh confirmed to India Today that he was in Chandigarh. Now, there are five cases of alleged extortion registered against Parambir Singh in various police stations of Thane and Mumbai. The former Mumbai police commissioner got major relief from the Supreme Court recently, which granted him protection from arrest. He was, in fact, asked to join the extortion probe. Parambir had cited threat to his life in his plea filed before the Apex Court. The probe by the CBI has also brought the attention back to a conversation between DGP Sanjay Pandey and former Mumbai police commissioner Parambir Singh, in which Pandey advised Parambir Singh to withdraw his allegations against former Maharashtra Home Minister Anil Deshmukh. In the conversation recorded by Parambir, Maharashtra DGP Sanjay Pandey has offered him a settlement under which ongoing inquiries against him would be settled. Sir, sir you have reached this, uh, this you, have, you have reached to join the investigation. What has the Supreme Court ordered you? Have, will you be cooperating with the investigation? I will definitely cooperate with the investigation as directed by the Honorable Supreme Court. I will honor the orders of the Supreme Court. You expect that you will get relief from the Supreme Court on the 6th of December? I have uh, brought all the facts and I expect justice. What, what do you expect? Uh, what do you think about the cases registered against you? Uh, whatever I have to say, I will say it in the court. Thank you, sir. So, Parambir Singh? This is a very serious thing. इस स्टेट के पुलिस के प्रमुख रहे हैं मुंबई के पुलिस के प्रमुख रहे ठाणा के पुलिस के प्रमुख रहे पूरी जिंदगी उन्होंने अपनी पुलिस में यहां पे महाराष्ट्र में बिताई उनको अगर खतरा लगता है उनके जान को तो किसी से खतरा है क्या खतरा है वो बताएंगे तो देख सकते हैं Right, so Parambir Singh, in fact, has reached the crime branch office in Mumbai in order to join the investigation. Remember, recently he had acquired protection from arrest from the Supreme Court. He had filed a plea in the Apex Court that there was a threat to his life in Maharashtra, which is why he was not in the state. India Today told you first that Parambir Singh is in Chandigarh. We spoke to him and now... We've spoken to him exclusively again as he has landed in Mumbai to join the investigation. Listen in. हमारे साथ हैं परमबीर सिंह पूर्व मुंबई पुलिस कमिश्नर सर ये बताएंगे आप इन्वेस्टिगेशन ज्वाइन करने के लिए आए हैं हाँ मैं इन्वेस्टिगेशन ज्वाइन करने आया हूँ सुप्रीम कोर्ट के आदेश के हिसाब से सर ये जानना चाहेंगे कि आगे की प्रक्रिया क्या होगी सुप्रीम कोर्ट ने प्रोटेक्शन दी है पर आगे आप फिर भी कोई अपील सुप्रीम कोर्ट ने उस प्रकार से मैं कॉपरेट करूंगा और सर ये जो केसेस केसेज रजिस्टर किए जा रहे हैं उस पर आपका क्या कहना है सर नहीं मुझे कुछ कहना नहीं है Right, Parambir Singh there saying exclusively to India today that he will cooperate with the investigation, that he expects justice and that he has, quote, brought all the facts with him, unquote. Parambir Singh there, of course, not commenting specifically on the extortion cases which have been registered against him in Maharashtra, a couple of those cases in Mumbai, a couple of those cases in Thane, and there are some investigations, open investigations that are being conducted by the Anti-Corruption Bureau as well. Parambir Singh recently had acquired himself protection from arrest by from the Supreme Court. The Supreme Court, in fact, uh, was surprised to note that a Mumbai police commissioner, a former commissioner, had come to the Supreme Court because he felt that he was unsafe in the state of uh, Maharashtra. My colleague Saurabh Bhaktania is now joining me live from Mumbai on this. Uh, Saurabh, Parambir Singh has reached the Crime Branch Unit 11 office in Mumbai in order to join the investigation as directed by the Supreme Court of India. And this is because the, the Maharashtra government did not file any sort of caveat, so he has protection from arrest. How is the Mumbai police now going to proceed in the various cases that they've lodged against him? 
So, Paula, me first of all, he has reached the Mumbai Crime Branch office at the Kandivali. This is the uh, Unit 11 of uh, Kandivali Crime Branch, and let me tell you the latest information right now that the DCP of Crime Branch, Mr. Nilaptal, is also here. He is going to take down the statement of Parambil Singh over here. This is very interesting. He is still uh, serving officer in the Maharashtra Police State, and uh, let me tell you, after this, Paula, me he is going to cancel the offender judgment which was put, put out by the court. So he is going to go after one by one to all places where the cases are registered against him. Paula, me let me tell you, total five FIRs are registered against Parambir Singh. Two in Mumbai, two in Thane, and one in Kalyan. And let me also tell you, there is two open inquiry against Parambir Singh at Anti Corruption Bureau of Maharashtra. It is going to be very interesting because time and again Parambir Singh is saying that he there is threat to his life and therefore he was not coming to Maharashtra. He was very much in India and never went out. And this is the car of DCP who has just reached over here. Mr. Parambir Singh is still inside. He is sitting inside the officer's room, which is inside the crime branch unit 11 office, where now uh, where now uh, the DCP has reached and he will be questioning. He will be actually taking down the statement of Parambir Singh. This is very in 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 interesting because let me tell you, the Maharashtra government is saying that the highest period of time Parambir Singh has served the state of Maharashtra. He has been the police commissioner of Mumbai. He has been with the force for so much long time. Then why is he afraid from his own force? So this is the question which the Maharashtra government leaders are time and again asking. But yes, after the order from the Supreme Court, he has now joined the investigation. Let me tell you, there are also two non-bailable warrant against Parambir Singh, which are issued by the Killa Court. So that he will try to cancel those non-bailable uh, uh, warrant which are issued against okay. him. The offenders order which are been issued by the court. So he will go from okay. Kandiwali Crime Branch Unit 11 to the Killa Court. Which so is basically, Parambir Singh is going to go about virtually clearing his name today in Mumbai. He wants to cancel the proclaimed offender's tag. He wants to cancel those two non-bailable arrest warrants which have been issued against him as well. And the DCP, in fact, has reached the Crime Branch Unit 11 office in Mumbai in order to question Parambi Singh. Saurabh, thank you so much for joining us.